is why some dog owners don't advocate for their dog, their pet. Honestly, I think the, the biggest reason, the most common reason is, is they don't know that they are not. They don't know that they're doing something wrong that's, that's harmful to the dog long-term or, or not helpful. Likely most common situations are the nervous, shy dogs, um, whether it's humans or dogs. And um, most of us have, have seen dogs who are on the shy or timid side that can warm up to other dogs or people, you know, with a little bit of time. There are others, a lot of others that I meet that it won't swing that direction. And the more you try to expose them to other people and dogs and it's overwhelming to them, then, then the, yeah, they're likely to, to become more fearful or, or want to avoid those situations more. It's the same with maybe some, some people don't know any better, I believe, and they, they believe that you need to be heavy handed because you've got a large dog or a strong breed and, and that can create problems. You may create a fearful and or aggressive dog um, by being too heavy handed or too forceful. Uh, but it's really, you know, people don't know better. I don't believe there's a lot of dog owners that, that don't advocate or, or do, do what's best for their dog intentionally. Some yes, but most, most no. 